Hello boys, girls, MBs, I'm Zenpai and welcome to my channel. Today, what we're going to be doing is we are going to be reacting to one individual song, one solo song from each of the seven BTS members. I thought that, um, you know, being a new BTS fan and learning um, a bit more about the members, I wanted to, you know, to, um, you know, before, you know, getting to, you know, know and, and listening to a BTS more as a group, I thought, hey, to get to know more about the members individually, it would kind of be cool to um watch a song from each of them as a solo song to kind of, you know, understand more about them individually and their styles and them, you know, themselves as individual artists. Because I think, you know, groups are really cool. It's because it's like, you know, artists all coming together to form a group and to make music together. But, you know, um, and they all bring their own individual sort of talents and individual styles together into one. So I thought that I would really like to um check out the, a song from the members individually to kind of see more about what their styles are, what the kind of music they do as individuals and what, what, what are they as artists solo so that's what we're going to be doing today so if you do end up enjoying this video please consider liking subscribing and joining the community on this channel and let's check out the first member that we're going to be seeing is um jun we're going to be watching the astronaut um which is an original song from him did i pronounce it all right jin jin yeah like jin um yeah so astronaut an original song from him so yeah i'm kind of excited to check this out so it's called astronaut i wonder if it's like like made like space or something Let's see what. So I think Jin's a singer, right? Because I know it says rappers and a singer. Is, it? is that a spaceship? It was like space themed because the song's called Astronaut. Wow. Wow! Wow, this is wow, this is really cool. This is this is interesting. Wow, he has a beautiful voice. I like the harmonies, wow. So it, maybe it's like is this about like is this like looking back at his childhood maybe? As he has he like been like fascinated by like space before? I'm not I'm not too sure. The music is really cool too, because like a kind of like a cinematic kind of um kind of vibe. It's really cool. Is this film? Is this like in America? I think this might be. Yeah, it looks like because it just definitely doesn't look like um Korea. That looks like a um, uh, um, in America or something. That looks like American. <laughs> the hell? No, run away! Okay. This is really, 
this is really awesome. But it's a really, I, I really like it. It's like, it's like a nice, like, it's a vibey kind of song. And I like the vocals too. I, the music video is interesting too. I, I, I really like this. So is this, um, hmm, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of like looking at those, I'm like, what is, hmm, what is like the, what is the message, it's like, it's like, it's like f feeling something that he's never felt before, hmm. Like, Maybe, maybe it's like, um, saying that, like, when he's with somebody that he loves, or that he's with a loved one, or, or maybe, like, he's, f like, falling in love, that he's, he hasn't felt this way about somebody before, and that, meaning, like, he, he feels like, you know, he's in outer space because of, because of his feelings for that person, like, hmm, I, I don't, hmm. This is really, I love this, it's really wholesome, it's really cool. Hitchhiking. Wow, I'm really, I'm really impressed by this. Wow, this is an amazing song. Honestly, this, wow. Yo, his handwriting's better than me. And, I, and, and English is my first language, shit. This, okay, this, this is, wow, I'm really impressed, like, like, just let's say, like, you know, if I was, you know, like, you know, um, talking about, like, oh, like, you know, listening to a song, right, from, like, a Korean artist, I would not, I would not, like, think that this would be a song from a Korean artist, you know, like, it, wow, like, I honestly, I was kind of getting, like, almost, like, um, Harry style kind of vibes in this song. I yeah, I thought this was really a really awesome song. Like wow, I I really loved it. I loved the realism. I loved the vibe of it. The I really loved his, um his vocals too. I, yeah, I thought it was really a really awesome song. This was so cool and it it's definitely outside of the realm of any like um you know, so like K, like you know, um, what maybe you would suspect from somebody who, you know, um, is, you know, from Korea, somebody who you know makes like you know, Korean music. I wouldn't. I've never heard like a Korean artist or like a Japanese artist like have a like do a song like this before. Like it's really amazing. I think it shows like such, um. 
a amazing like versatility that he has as an artist. Like I, I'm I'm just really impressed. I think that was an amazing song. Wow, wow. I really loved this song. This is a great song. Like wow, honestly. Okay, so next we have J Hope with Daydream. I think I think J Hope's is J Hope a rapper? Or Oh, oh wait, 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 I forgot the, I've got the captions, okay, okay, I, I remember the captions, I remember the captions. Hope well, dude. That sounds good and half and half for no. Going in the sun, you know, kind of life for no. Couldn't you open and daddy had a jung for no? Nearly gone sang a child in the sun for no. Can you go I know, which in the logo spunger. I know, sang it's a leg spunger. I know, yeah, I know, I know, I know. Cause me, I'm a go get her and go back at cheese. I'm a guy to go to win a young man and a good mood. Yeah, I'm a dog and she's a little dog peen. I go him to Nagas and a nom number. Yeah, not her show, go boom boom. I'm a boy, I'm a good girl. 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 I'm a good
이렇게 왜 꿈을 꾸냐 되묻는다면 배부른 소리 할 거야 yeah. 잠시 내려놓고 난 메커니즘에 맞게 스테이 쉬는 거라 할 거야 yeah. What's this what's this 공상 속 답은 모두 나의 연습 <웃음> Like this like this 모두 나의 바자취와 나의 fantasy If I want something If I want something now If I want something If I want something now They grew They grew Hey yo yo look at his move okay Okay They grew He's kinda he's kinda slayed Oh yo Oh, oh, maybe I was right. Maybe I, maybe I was right. It, it's like it's like he's having, he's dreaming. I'm, I'm a genius. I'm a, I'm a genius. I'll, I'll, give my, I'll give myself a pat on the back for that. I'll give myself a pat on the back for that. <laughs> that was, that was really cool. Though. I, I really liked. I loved that story. That was like I I it was like a it's a fun like groovy kind of song and I I I, I like that kind of music you know I was really quite cool. loved the visuals I loved he just I don't know, he has just a natural kind of like he's you know he he has a like grooviness that I really like it's like it, it's fun I feel that's really cool I feel he has this fun kind of vibe to him I think it's really cool I, I like his dance moves too I like the visuals it was just fun I think it was really cool I like that it's kind of a song I just. I was like, I can go like, you know, jam out to. I really like that. That was, yo, I'm, I'm really liking these songs so far though. They're really cool. Um, okay, so next we have R M with Anderson. Who's I? I'm sorry, I, I don't. I, I'm not sure who that is. Oh, a Mel. He's an American rapper. Oh, damn. Am I just <laughs> uncultured? Maybe I, I don't know. Um, so. So R M is R M also a rapper? Yeah, main. Oh, R O it's R M. Yeah, main rapper. Yeah. Okay. So yeah. So next we have Still Life. Are you on a train? But it's actually, it's actually, you know, um, kind of, like, amazing, like, how, like, BTS has kind of, like, become, like, really, like, worldwide, you know, like, they're collaborating with, like, American artists, I'm pretty sure that I know that one of them did a song with Charlie Proof, and that they've been, like, that they're one of their songs, um, I'm not, I'm not entirely sure, like, what members, but, like, um, was in the, in the, like, member video that I watched, it said they were, like, there was a song on Eternals, Marvel. I think this is, like, impressive. It's so, like, impressive that they really, um, you know, have integrated themselves into, like, into the West as well. Like, into America and stuff and being able to corrupt with American artists. I think it's really cool. I'm still alive. I'm still alive. Is this, a, is this in English? I'm still alive. I'm still alive. Oh yeah, cause R, cause R M's fluent in English, right? Yeah, somebody told me that he, so he, he's fluent in English, Korean, and Japanese. So he's trilingual. That's that's insane though. Wow. Okay. Because yeah, I, I wasn't sure if he spoke Japanese as well, but somebody in the comments told me he, he's fluent in Japanese too. Life is better than death, I'll prove it. 
I would hope so. I, w- I would hope. I would hope that um, if somebody's watching this, if I, I hope that they, you know, would feel like life is better than death. I, I would hope so. You know, my like, please. Okay, if, if you if you do think that um, living is like death is better than living, then seek help, please. I I I like what these um like, like J Hope and like R M like so far like it's not like it's kind of like they they it's you know it's rap but then it's kind of got this like poppy kind of vibe to it I don't know it's like it's got like a grooviness to it you know it's not um it doesn't feel like entirely what I mean as in I think um. It can definitely have like symbolisms um, in the lyrics and in the realism, but it can also, it, but it also has this like groovy, this catchy kind of, um, you know, vibe and enjoyment that you can get out of it. Don't listen to the haters or hurt your ears. That, that is true. That is true. Okay, this kind of has, I feel like this kind of has a positive, um, indie, like, message to it. I feel like it's, it's kind of saying, you know, like, oh, forget about the haters, you know, I'm here, you know, I'm, I'm living my life, you know, I'm moving forward, you know, I'm like, okay, okay, I'm kind of, I'm, I'm trying to, like, you know, um, see the lyrics, and like, oh, what is, what is the meaning of this song? Hey, oh, <laughs> what's that? You doing, oh, I'm saying. What does it say? I know what you're saying, bro. Hey, <laughs> Pa, what's up? You doing? Anderson Park. Pack. P A K or something. So, so is, 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 is he gonna come in? Is Anderson gonna come in? It's gonna be what's gonna be, bro. You just gotta do your thing. Yeah, come on. I'm still alive. I love that I'm still alive. Okay, maybe it's like yeah, like look at me. I'm still living. I'm still alive. You know, I'm I'm moving forward. The haters can't stop me. You know, like you, you can't lock me up. I'm living my life. I'm moving forwards. You know, the haters they just hurt your ears. Forget about those haters. Move. Continue on, keep on moving, and live your life. You're still life. You're still living your life. It's like. Yeah, and it's like life is better than death. I'll prove it. You know, it's like I'll prove to you. Yeah, it's it's worth living. Like life can be good. You know, you're still life. There's still life to be had. But keep on moving forward. Okay, I I really love. I really like the message. I feel like it has this. It has like a cool, like your yeah, positive message to it. It's like you know, um, like moving forwards from like hardship and and kind of you know being like you know they may lock you up. That there, there's gonna be haters, but don't listen to those haters because all they do just hurt your ears. Yeah, it's like just live now, go forward. Yeah, yeah. This is this is such an awesome song. I really love the message of this song. It's really cool. This has like a positive, really fun mess. Like a really um, a really positive message. I mean, it's a really um catchy, um really awesome fun song to listen to. But then it has a a positive message, kind of like help people that listen to this. You maybe you're you're down and maybe you're not feeling the best at the moment or like the, the, the situation that you are in at life right now and this is kind of like I, feel, I really love this kind of like an uh, encouraging message just saying like you know um I'll prove that life is better than death 
just now, just live now going forward. Yeah, keep on moving, keep on moving forward. Don't listen to what people have to say about you. Don't, you know, don't concentrate on the negatives. Think of the positives. Keep on moving, keep on moving forward. Life is gonna get better. You know, pro I'll prove that living is better than death. It's like this. Yeah, this is an awesome song. I really, lo I really love the message of this song. I, I really appreciate um, BTS and their members and that they they generally seems like they have a lot of positive messages in their songs and and it's I really love songs that like um, you know it, it it's nice and fun to listen to but at the same time it has a really um, not like deep message to it. it has a it has a meaning to it you know and I think this song kind of embodies that in that sense I mean it's really awesome Yeah, I wow, I really loved this song. I think this is, oh, I think this is like one of those songs that really nice think that can help people, you know, in the sense of like um like wow, I I really love I really love him as an artist. I think I really love um the the positivity that he's giving to people and I feel like this this can help a lot of people um listening to this song because it's kind of like I feel like it's one of those songs where maybe you're having a bad day and or like you know you're not having the best time right now and you listen to this song and maybe it can help you you know to push you forwards you know and I think that's kind of what BTS as a band does for a lot of people and all of the army and I feel like this song kind of embodies in, in you know in essence of like what music can do for people it can it can um lift people up when they're down you know when you're not having the best day when you're sad or maybe you're depressed and you're listening to music can help you and can help your um feel at least a little bit better and i think this kind of song really embodies that and it has such a really amazing message you kind of you know um remember you know, keep st you're still alive you're still alive you know keep on moving yeah don't listen to the haters don't listen to those people that have negative things to say about you keep on moving forwards and prove those people wrong you know i'll prove that living is better than death it's like that's such an amazing song it's such amazing um like realism i i yeah i just really love this song this is an amazing song honestly props props to rm this is a great song um okay next we have honestly how do i so is it august d Al august d august d august d i know that's um this is uh Su suga is this that how you pronounce it so SUG Sugar 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 Okay, so, so I think um August D is like is that his stage name? Is that what is is it is that what is like his rapper name? Is that like is that just another name for him, I guess? Yeah, I think I guess so. Um so I uh, yeah. So we have August D with August D music video, okay? So what is it six years ago, okay? So he, I mean, he's also a rapper. Okay, this 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 seems more like possibly more like traditional rap. Okay, this could, this gives me kind of like um what I heard from like the like mic drop kind of um kind of song, sort of like that um yeah from like it's just one of the one of the songs, one of the only songs I've listened to be tested for. But I think it reminds me kind of like it gives me kind of like the mic drop kind of um, vibes of a of song. <laughs> oh, oh oh oh! I forgot the captions. I forgot the fuck off the captions. 
one of the captions. Yo, yo, I can saw he swore. <gasps> oh, f wait, fuck you, I'm a pain in your ass. <laughs> fuck you, I'm a pain in your ass. I'm a damn, okay, okay, damn, okay, yo, damn. Yo, sh damn, okay, shit. Okay, yo, yo, K pop, K pop category isn't big for me. Okay, so kind of like, oh, look, I guess really cool. So kind of like he's saying that, like, I, you know, don't, I guess, don't categorize me as a, as a K pop artist. You know, I'm, I'm more than that. I'm, I'm more than just a K-pop um, artist, you know, I'm more than just a K-pop star, you know, I'm, I'm more than that. <laughs> Kissing my ass? Whoa, my, my seat is business, you economy. Okay, okay, I'll just... just okay, wow. You 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 just hit heard in me like that, that that's true. Uh, I mean, to be honest, I feel like there would be some people that love to kiss your ass. That would be Oh my god, yo, yo, he, he's fucking spitting. My man. What? Rap is so B, I always get to fat dick them. What the? What does that mean? I get to fat dick them. What does that mean? Oh, yo, my man, my man, what is that? What is, what is, what is, what is get fat, get to fat dick mean? I don't know what that means, yo. Hey, yo. <laughs> Yo, yo, he, yo, he, yo, he's a fucking beast. Like, yeah, I don't need no fucking breaks. I'm, I'm not gonna keep on fucking going 24/7. Like, damn, okay, okay, my boy. I mean, honestly, that's respectable. You know, it's he's got in here because he works fucking hard. You know, he's worked belly fucking hard to get where he is. Honestly. That's that's respect. That's respect right there. You know that gives me motivation to work um, to work hard too. Because if you want to, you know, if you want to get to, if you want to achieve what you want, you want to achieve your goals or your dreams, you have to work hard for it. You know, I yeah, but I, I respect my boy. I respect my boy right there. <laughs> You, you are you are a freak lunatic on that fucking beat my boy Oh. 
Good health is all you got now, mum's gonna be upset when you- Whoa! Whoa, that's a bit toxic! Yo, whoa, whoa, man, yo, hey, yo, whoa, that's a bit- That's kind of toxic, are you- Are you- What are you- You're gonna- What, are you gonna take away their health? Yo, that- Good health? Yo, that's a bit toxic, I'm- Is that what he meant? Maybe that's probably not what he meant, I don't know. Okay, so kind of- So kind of this is like- Maybe this is like a message kind of like to his competition? I- I feel like maybe like rapping about the the competition that he's faced maybe in the industry of like with other rappers maybe and of like the adversity that he's faced to getting to where he's at now and talking about oh like all these other people are jealous of me but you know they don't know my tongue technique they don't know i'm working 24 7 you know i'm not just a k-pop artist i'm so much more than that you can't categorize me you can't keep me in a small box you know you know, all these, all these people so jealous of me. They don't know my tongue technique. They don't know that I'm working 24-7. I don't take a break. I'm busting my ass off, you know. I'm, I'm working harder than you. I'm working 24-7. I've got no free days on my calendar, you know. I deserve where I've gotten to. I deserve my success because I've worked my ass off for it. And you're just over there, you know. You're fucking jealous of me. It's like, you know, I'm okay, it's like, okay? Wait, he's a turned on. Wait a minute. Oh, I rap and you'll get turned on by my tongue technology. Like, turned on sexually? Or... Or... Ayo? I mean, I mean, I, maybe not meant... That's, maybe it's not meant like... They may not meant like in a sexual way. I don't... I, what, I mean, what other terminology do you use getting turned like turned on for though? Besides like in a in like in the, like the sexual way. I don't, I don't know. Okay, yo, that was sick. My man, my man is fucking slaying. Holy, this part is just so good. That that's true. That's true. This yo. This was a fucking banger. This was a banger. He's a fucking king. Yo, I, I, I like you know. I, I respect people. You know, he, he doesn't give a fuck. Yo, he's like fuck you. I'm like yeah, king. yeah. I'm like go, go fuck you, go fucking king. Spit your fucking shit, king. Spit your fucking shit. Spit your fucking shit, king. Yo, uh, fucking shit. Spit your shit. Spit your fucking shit, king. You know, fucking rap on those fucking haters. Fucking do it, king. Yo, I, I fucking. I rate it. I rate it, King. Yeah, I, yeah. That was that was awesome. Dude, these songs are fucking sick. These are all amazing so far. I'm, yeah. This is. I'm. Imp I'm so impressed. Like all these songs so far, are so fucking good. Honestly, really fucking good. Okay, so next we have, is it J Jin Min? Jin Min? Oh, okay, alright. Jin Min. Jin Min. Jin Min. Jin Min. Jin Min. Jin Min. So I think he's a he's the he's a singer. Uh the Jimin lead vocalist, yes, yeah. So Jimin's the singer. Is a singer. Well I guess he's more than just a singer, he can dance and stuff too, but you know you know what I mean. Um so yeah, so Jimin oh this is only two months ago. Like clay like crazy. Hmm. Official music video. ASMR, the, was, was this ASMR? The, I'm afraid that everything will disappear. Just trust me. She sang, baby, sing, I'll catch you, my, that's not a bad thing here tonight. And baby, don't, I don't know why, so don't I catch you, my. Watch 
So is this is this a love song or I guess it's kind of saying about like this is like a, he's in like a club but yeah. Um, yeah. Ew, okay, so is this like, is this like, I guess, like a song about like having a good night, like enjoying like the night, I guess, like a, the night life? And, like hooking up, having like hookups with people, or I'm not. Sure. I'm I'm a younger person, so I've not like I've not somebody like I'm young. I'm a younger person, so I've not actively like you know gone out to like clubs and and parties, you know, and like drunk the night away. So I'm not entirely sure. Um, I might not be right about like the the messaging, but I don't know if I have to like have experience in that to like know like the message of the song. But I kind of like feel like maybe it's like um. Really like singing about like you know, like um having fun, singing about like nightlife and like um you know uh like yeah like not wasting your life. I I don't know. I feel like I guess I guess it's just like a song about just like the nightlife, like club, just like having a good time. It's like enjoying the good ride. I mean, like it's like it's like sex. It's not like like hooking up or. Like falling in love, or like with somebody, like hooking up with somebody, or <sighs> hold on again. What's the point? What is on his hands, huh? Hmm. Like, hmm. I'm honestly, I'm not a hundred percent sure on on the messaging for this song. I'm not I'm honest. I'm not. I'm not a hundred percent sure, because I'm not sure. Like, what's what's on his hands? I'm not. Hmm. Huh. Yeah. I'm not. I'm not a hundred percent sure. Um. You guys can let me know in the comments. Um. I should we say the most blue play part? What is the most blue play part? The the music video is really like well filmed though. It's like. I, but I was kind of getting like, a bit dizzy, like, you know, like, it was like... 
you know, it's kind of like in a, a bit of a trance, like, oh god. But, um, so, so I mean, let me know if, um, if, if you want to, like, let me know if I got, like, if I got something wrong about, like, the, the meaning of this song in the comments. I mean, I'm not, I, I don't, like, I'm not trying to be, like, that, you know, trying to be somebody that knows everything. Um, I just try to, like, say my own perspectives and, you know, try to come to my own conclusions, like, what, I think this song might be saying, if you know what I mean. But um, yeah, okay, let's move on to the next one. But but yeah, Jimin has like I really liked. He has really a really beautiful voice though. I think he has a really like, a, like a angelic kind of voice. And he has a really um a really nice voice, a nice singing voice. And I like the music video, the way it was filmed. It was really um, it was really cool. Um, okay, so next we have Love Yourself. Which one? Uh, who's which one is this? Is this is um. It's V, oh, it's V, okay, so V is, is V also a vocalist? Yeah, V, okay, so V's a vocalist. Okay. And, um, so this is, I think this is a, a I think this is a solo song on a BTS album? BTS Love Yourself Tear Segurity? Uh, I'm sorry, I can't, I can't read, I, I have dyslexia. Singularity. Single singularity. Okay, so I uh, so I think this is a this is a song on the on the BTS um this is a, this is a solo song on a BTS album from V. Oh, oh, oh cap captions captions. What what the hell is going on? That's not a person. That's like a that's a coat hanger. Uh, that's what I'm really cool that like you can you can kind of, you can see that like all of them as artists are that they're, they're different you know they're not they're not the same they don't make the same kinds of music you know i think that's really awesome and i think it's really um cool that they can all come together you know as a, i think that's the great thing about groups is that um you know that they're, they're all individual artists with their own individual styles and they all come together to make um music as one is a, a coherent group but then they can but then, but then you can still you know make your own things as well and your own projects and you can still see oh you know these are still individual artists with their own styles and their own kinds of music they want to make and that their own messages they want to you know convey <laughs> Dancing though, I, I feel like like this like slow kind of like almost like this um whispery like deeper voice he's singing. And I, I I think it's really I, I, it's it's really it's like intriguing. so interesting i'm like i might i might I, i'm like inv i'm invested i'm like i'm tr like what, what is the message for this song <laughs> Oh, so 
Wow, that was... I'm not... I'm not honestly entirely sure, like, what the the meaning of this song was, honestly. Or what the the symbolisms, or even, like, the music video was. It was really... it's really intriguing. Really, like, honestly, it felt like it had a deep meaning to it. It's just, like, covering his face at the end. It's sort of like, looking at the reflection in the lake and in the water. Hmm. Is it is it talking about insecurity? Or well, I'm not entirely sure. Um, is it talking about like not wanting not wanting to show your face or being insecure about showing yourself, like showing your face? I'm not I'm not entirely sure. Um, because of what we're, there's a lot of songs to get to the seven songs. Um, I I I don't have the time to re rewatch it go too deep into it but um let me let me know um i i'm not entirely sure i feel like this might be one of those songs where you i kind of have to like re-watch it to kind of get a better idea of what the meaning is but that was really cool though. i really loved the way he he sung and i like, really a more like slower um like deep kind of like almost like he's like whispering kind of like um kind of way i thought that was wow that was really that was really interesting really intriguing to a watch they're, they're all really amazing though. Okay, so the last song that we have t today with the last member, um, so is I'm gonna, let me, let me not, let me translate so I don't butcher his name. Jungkook. Jungkook? Jungkook? Jungkook. Jungkook. Um, Euphoria. Film. Theme of love yourself. Theme of love yourself. Hmm. Let's love yourself. Hmm. Maybe. Theme. Is this a? Is this anything or? No. Okay. I'm not. I'm not sure. Okay. I thought it was like a. I thought it meant like is it a theme like a movie or something? Is it maybe not? Okay. So yes, we have the last song for today, but the final um and the seventh member of a BTS. So yeah, Euphoria, Theme of Love Yourself by um Jun Jun Cook. Oh, this is eight eight minutes and fifty two seconds. Huh? Oh, okay. Wait it whoa, what is happening here? Whoa. Um 
Oh my god, yo, whoa, 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 um... Whoa, what is, what is happening here? Oh my god. Am I missing context? Maybe, I don't know. So is this a Jun Cook song just like the others are just in the music video? Because I, I don't hear the others singing. So maybe it's just it's just them in the music video maybe. <laughs> so I'm, not, I'm not entirely sure because I looked at the website that, that said what the original songs are, so I don't know if I'm wrong, this isn't an original song. I mean well not, not an original song, but this isn't a solo song. <laughs> I like the vocals and the, the, the instrumentals too, it's like... Is, is these captions not... I don't think these captions are working. Is, is this, does this song not have subtitles? Oh, it does not have captions. I was like, yeah, I was wondering, I was like... That is that is not that is not that is not right. This song doesn't have captions. That's kind of okay, we just might just get rid of them then. I 
feel like this this video is really intriguing too. I feel like that's what it was. Like this video is really intriguing as well. I'm like, an it seems interesting. What's happening in this video? Mm. It is eight minutes and fifty two seconds. It's like it's longer. So I'm like, what's hmm. Yeah, so 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 seven of them. Hmm. Are they gonna jump? They don't don't jump, popcorn. I mean, one of them jumped off the top of the beginning, so I don't know. Do they just all jump off now? Oh, that wow, I okay, so these are the credits. I'm wow, I'm really oh my god, wow, I'm really intrigued by that. Wow, the that was a really that was a that was a really nice like song, too. It was a really beautiful song, but the the music, the video has me really intrigued. It seems like there's a lot of like symbolisms and like meaning in that video, like. I'm, I'm, I'm really like wondering, I was like, what, is, what was happening in that video? Hmm... But I, I, do, I did really like the song, he's, he has such a, he has a really beautiful voice though, um... I, I really like the instrumental and I like the hook. Like, I thought, I, I, I liked, I, I did, I did like the song. Okay, so, um, you yeah, let me know in the comments if, um, this might, it's might because it's like, maybe I miss, uh, there's some context I'm missing or something, or is it one of those things that you have to listen to other songs to connect it to this or something like that, or I'm not, I'm not entirely sure, but you want me to know in the comments, but um, yeah, so that was, um, one into, one solo song from each of the BTS members, um, yeah, that was really awesome, um, I think that was a good way of me kind of to, um, get to know all of the members of BTS, in, in, a, in you know, as an individual and as an individual artist and I thought yeah I thought they were all really amazing I think they all have their own distinct kind of um styles and their own kinds of music they want to make and I think they all did a really fucking amazing job they're all amazing artists and they're all very talented um I think they all have really great meanings and symbolisms in their songs um and I, I like their different styles and because they all you know they all have something different to um bring in their own songs their own unique kind of styles and their own music and I think it's really cool that um as a group they let each other go and do um solo projects and and let them do solo things I think that helps with the longevity of a group because I think there's some groups that like they don't want anybody in the group to do individual projects I think that that is that I think that is a way to get the group to break up because then one person virtually leaves because they want to do individual stuff but they're getting, they can't do individual stuff because they're part of the group. So I think like um, them being open enough to like letting each other do individual things and do individual projects and have individual songs, I think that's going to help them in the longevity of keeping a healthy group and ha keeping a healthy kind of um, relationship with each other. Um, and I, I, you know, because I think, I think it makes sense that, like, if you're in a group, you know, um, you may get, you may want 
to make some things individually for yourself you know as a you know you're an artist you're a singer you're a rapper you know it makes sense that you'd want to at least i'm a little bit go and make some and do some individual projects or individual songs but um yeah that was really really um cool i really enjoyed um listening to um individual songs and i think i i am now um you know getting to know them more as individuals and individual artists a bit better i hope that you guys did enjoy this concept of a video um reacting to one one solo song from each of the bts members but um yeah i hope that you guys did enjoy if you did enjoy please consider liking please consider liking and subscribing and join the community on this channel i'm subscribing just let me know that you guys enjoyed this video and you'd like to see more um, and leave um suggestions down below in the comments to what if there's any um suggestions they'd like to give me of anything that you'd like me to check out um yeah any video ideas you'd like to give me um that would be very much appreciated also um definitely do um tell me if there's anything i missed um if there's anything you'd like anything you'd like to tell me about the individual members and individual songs but yeah thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys in the next one Bye bye